keep it up. Um, I put a purple colour with the blue just to add a bit of contrast just because I thought it would be a bit with the sky being blue and the, uh, you know, so yeah, there we go. Oh, that was awkward in your chat today. I was not. I hey, we're live now. Watch out. We're live. Oh, heaven's sakes. Okay. <laughs> You're trying to kill me, aren't you? <laughs> I told you, but I think we didn't hear me, so I'm saying it again. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, Hello to people on Facebook. Facebook. Hello, um, there's a little, I, I have to, I just want to let people know on Facebook that I have to go back and forth um, between reading the chat in Facebook and reading the chat on YouTube. So uh, bear with me when I have to, when it takes me a few minutes to go back and forth between the two chats and reading them. But greetings to everybody in YouTube and Facebook. So far, nobody's in the chat on YouTube. And Is this I don't know. Sorry. Yeah. Are we just doing a test now? Is this just like no, a No, this is live now. We're actually live. Right, okay. I'm, I'm fine. I, I can do this. We can do this, Diana. <laughs> yeah, so let me check Facebook now. I will be right back. I will just go and get my water. Okay. Um, that's the only thing I forgot. I'll be right back. And anybody in YouTube watching? I'm going to check anybody in the chat. Let's say... Check for anybody in the chat in YouTube. I mean, not in YouTube, in Facebook. I'll be going back and forth. Uh, Gracie is painting the famous landmark. The famous landmark, Big Ben in London. Yeah. And so far, we have nobody, somebody liked it, but nobody... Nobody's watching in Facebook right now, okay? But oh, that's okay. We'll, we'll get viewers, don't worry. <laughs> I, I did get viewers the other day, but yeah, that's, that's okay. I get okay. Facebook, I'm, I'm gonna be going back. Oh, we got some, we got people in chat, and um, cool. we got people in chat in here and YouTube. Hi, guys. Hello, Hi. Hello, Shay's world. He came back. She was in the morning, she was in my morning grow stream, and I told everybody about the one o'clock. The yep. one o'clock painting. So Shay's World took the invite. Oh, Goswina is here. Hello, guys. That's nice. Sylvia, um, Amas, uh, Sylvia Amas, I think you're new to the live stream. Hello, Sylvia. Yep. Hello, everybody. Um, okay. So, Big Ben it is then. Yep. He said, "I told you I would come." Oh yeah, Shay's World. I didn't know. I didn't know if you meant like you uh, you were going to go to another live, a grow stream this week with uh, of the other team members. If I'd see you there, I, I didn't know that, or if you, I'd see you this afternoon. But thank you. So that's great seeing you. How do you like my new watercolor, Diana? Those little discs—they just fit on there nicely. Look, they're just—they're just children's. Let me pens. give you the big screen. Okay, I'm going to give um, Gracie the big screen now. Oh. I, I get I, I go off and big screen. Oh, what are, those? are those Arteza? Uh, no, they're not actually. They are. I will tell you the brand. This is the brand. Um, they're just children's paints. Um, and I just thought they'd be fun for um because they fit on my table quite easily there. Wait. So yeah. and I can. Um, You're using children's watercolor paints today. They are. Yeah. I, oh I my like goodness! Them. Yeah, I have to tell everybody, Gracie use it doesn't just use children's watercolor paint she uses oh, very she, there, she has a she has a collection of watercolor paints including very expensive watercolor paints holbein which is very yeah. expensive so there are times where she does use very expensive watercolor paints but she has a big collection of watercolor paints and today she just so happens to be using children's watercolor paints i you know so that's just what she's using today but uh, she does have very expensive watercolor paints that she just doesn't. She's not happy. She's just choosing not to use today. Yeah. That's. Uh, thank you. Yep. That's uh, that's the gist of it, really. There we go. And the painting. I'm really happy with this painting. I I was um I was a little bit worried about getting it right, but I think I've done a, a really good job at getting contrast on this one, Diana. Um. Oh yeah, yeah you do. Yeah. What do the guys in chat think? 
Ian's here. Hi, Ian. And I told every I told you who else is here. I, oh, Madonna's here now. Hi, Madonna. Susan Hi, Ice is here. A bunch of new people. Susan Ice is here. Oh, hello. Nice to see you all. And we are dual broadcasting between to YouTube and Facebook, so I have to watch the chat. So far, nobody is watching in Facebook. We got a like. We did get a like. Somebody put a uh, put a heart on it, not a thumbs oh. up, but a heart. But nobody, so far, nobody is watching in Facebook, and but we got tons of people watching on YouTube. Yeah, that's good. Awesome. Thank you for watching, guys. It all helps. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes. and the paper that I'm using today is uh, the Windsor and Newton professional paper. Um, and it's very new to me. I've never used their brand new line and their new uh, Windsor and Newton watercolour professional paper. They have a grey cover on them. Um, and it's not to be confused with the Cotman watercolour paper, which is by the same company, Windsor and Newton. So, you know. I mean, the Cotman paper might be okay just for practicing um, or colour swatches or colour theory. Um, and then you'd like to get some more professional paper. Um, yeah. Yeah. So there we go. Let's put Big Ben up there. I don't know where to put it down. I don't know where to put my painting so I can see it. There we go. You need, you need to see the painting while you paint, right? Yeah. I, ha I haven't got that technical yet. Lean it up against something? You can't lean it up against... No, we don't need to see it. We don't need to see it. If you, you could lean it up or... It doesn't have to be on camera. Oh, that's a good idea. Um, I can possibly put it there. Oh, there we go. Perfect. There we go. Right. So, shall I just sit here and, um, and draw you it? Get and started. Then... Go ahead and get started. Okay. Thank you. Let's see. Oh, are you wearing your pajamas? I am. <laughs> she's not. A, she's not afraid to tell you. We no, can no. By the arm. I can see by the arm. I remember when uh, when I was on panel with Bobby uh, sometime last year. I can't remember when, and I had that big purple um, dressing gown on, and I said, "Oh, I'm in my I'm in my dressing gown, Bobby." And he said, "Oh, well, you didn't have to tell me." <laughs> Oh, that's a good name. That's a good name for the stream, though. Painting in your pajamas. Yeah, that'd be good. I could, I could put that. I could put that in the share when I share on my community tab. I could say because already they know that you're going to paint Big Ben, and then I could say, yeah. painting in your pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> She's painting in her pajamas. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, JPT here. Hello. Hello. If you have already. Please hit the oh, thank you, Susan Ice. Remember, people to hit the thumbs up. Please hit the thumbs up. That's right. And oh, uh, and for all for our lovely host, thank you, Susan Ice. Thank you. Then thumbs up and share it out on your community tab, Twitter, Facebook, and what other places. Those are the three places I usually share out to. But if you yeah. have other like, there's always LinkedIn and tons of other places like Tumblr that. I don't know. There's just so many other places, but the most popular places are um, Twitter, Facebook, and your community tab. If you have a thousand subscribers or more, you'll have a community tab. And then I I forget who else. There's other social media places, but um, they're less. Fancy, I'm not fancy schmancy just yet, Diana. <laughs> fancy schmancy with what? Um, with the with the old uh, community, what is it? You said community, community tab. tab. Oh yeah, I think you need to have a thousand subscribers to have a community tab. Oh okay. <laughs> no, not got that far yet. So this is Westminster. What I'm drawing in now. Can everybody see the lines? Yeah. Uh. Yes. Yeah. I can. Can you, can you everybody see the lines? Or yeah. line drawing? I'm trying to make it as dark as possible so you guys can see. Sometimes no. you can. Yeah. Sorry. Carry on. You're the host. Well, sometimes when you start, I mean, when you do start painting, you should move everything over. I don't know. I don't know oh. if you're left. Yeah, that way. You should move everything more over that way so we can see your whole picture. 
There you go. Sorry, guys. How many people have visited London? I never have. I've been to Europe, but actually, I've never been to the UK. I've uh, been to Europe. Uh huh. And visited uh, several countries in Europe, but uh, never made it to the UK. How many people have been to? How many people have been to the UK or Europe? Good question. Let's see, we have Goswina here from the Netherlands. Oh, hi, Skeeter. Hello, Skeeter. Oh, Skeeter's comment is color me beautiful. Oh. <laughs> yep. Ian says he's been to the UK. Of course, Ian, <laughs> been, he lives in the UK. <laughs> Ian's been to the UK, yep. <laughs> oh, Su Susan, Susan Ice says, she has been to Bermuda, and Bermuda is owned by the UK, right? I mean, owned by England. Okay. I've been to Bermuda also. So, oh, if you're going to count Bermuda oh, as UK territory, or as the English territory, British territory, okay, I guess I've been there because I've been to Bermuda also. Oh, there you go. Bermuda, wow. Is that the same the Bermuda Triangle? I Yes, Flew, we act no, not flew. Our cruise ship did go through the Bermuda Triangle. Oh, now I get it. <laughs> Sorry. And Kate <laughs> World said she wished she she could draw. Oh, yeah, wow. Kate World, I taught elementary school art for twenty five years, and I can teach. I even can teach little children how to draw. Like suppose, yeah. you know, like I can teach them how to draw. If I can teach them how to draw, I could teach you how to draw it because it you break it down to basic shapes first yeah which is what i've done with this um mm -hmm. and it's mainly columns you get a big column and then you've got i don't know what they're called these little um uh, on the uh on the clock i don't know uh, um, i don't know what they're called but um they're kind of um i just kind of broke it down and i thought well, I'm not a, I'm not a very um, I'm not a super realistic painter. I'm more of an impressionistic painter when it comes to mm -hmm. like these kinds of paintings because um, it really suits watercolor. And it just depends on how you want to paint, really. I mean, um, just go with what you like to do, you know. Oh, we have a bunch of new people in here. Let me read them off. We have on the farm. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. No, on the on the farm with JT. Yes, he's never come to one of our painting streams. Oh, 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 oh welcome JT. And we have Vermont Paint and Photos. He he, and we know him. But here's a new person. Vlogs by Bud. Is that Bud? But Vlogs by Bud. Is that Bud Klein? I think that's Bud Klein. Yeah. Is that you, Bud Klein? Vlogs by Bud. Is that your second channel? I, I remember seeing that the other day. Oh, let me check Facebook. We're dual live streaming today to Facebook and YouTube. Let me check. Oh, nothing's going. Nobody's there on Facebook. Okay. That's okay. Yeah. Please thumbs up the live. Yeah, that, that will help. And share it, share it out to your community tab, Twitter, Facebook, and any other and any other of your favorite social links. Yeah. Oh, Vlogs by Bud changed his name. So he uh, went out on the channel. Instead of Bud Klein, he's called Vlogs by Bud. Thanks for letting us know. Yep, thank you. That's good that we know. Otherwise, we would be guessing, wouldn't we? Hello, everybody in the chat. Uh, can you still see the pencil lines? I mean, you can my, my end. I see can. Everybody, can you see the pencil lines? Just so I, you know, just so I know kind of thing. Yep. Let me see. Let's see. Now then. Uh, this is Westminster on the left. And that's the bridge and that's the River Tame. Uh, let's see. I'm going to add some more squares in here. So I'm just kind of just putting in basic shapes, really. Oh. And then, yes, I can see. Sorry. Carry on. For the most part, for the most part, we can see, but it is it, it is a little bit light. But 
you're only going to be doing this not for that long because basically you're i mean it's the painting that you're going to be doing for most of the time you're only going to be doing this like drawing for like the next five minutes or so oh yeah i'm not going to be i'm not i'm nearly done now um, yeah it did. so if you can't see the drawing that well it's okay it, um it's okay because she's going to be mainly painting this is just going to go this is just preliminary and, and she'll be just doing this for five minutes or less yeah i'm pretty quick at drawing now so Thank you, Diana. Not in my name. Oh, let's see how many people are in chat. Uh, oh, shout out to the 11 people watching. Excellent. Hello, Hello everybody watching. Hope you hit the thumbs up. And yeah. thank you if you did. Yeah, thank you. Do you want to know something funny about this painting? I found the numeral, the Roman numerals in the clock really tricky to get on there. Because <laughs> it's like, it's a very small circle. And I was like, oh, I've got to put all those Roman numerals in there. Ooh. That was actually, that was possibly one of the hardest things to do in this painting, as daft as that sounds. Really? Yeah. I have no idea why. Let's see. Because Big Ben really is the focal point, isn't it, as a whole, you know? Yes, I get it. Yes, it's a focal point. Yeah. That's what they call it. <laughs> oh, oh, he's explaining. Bud is, Bud, is, Bud is explaining why he changed his name. Oh. Oh, hi, old beer buzzard. Hello. Nearly done now. Oh no, listen to what he said. Oh, mm. oh, I thought he said Bono. He says, my boom boom song. Warning, DNG. He's talking about us, DNG. I'm Diana, you're crazy. DNG. No one under 21 can listen to his boom boom song. Hi, everyone. Thumbs number. Th thumbs, thumbs number what? Thumbs number what? Are you, what thumb number are you, did you hit? <laughs> oh, buzzard. Oh, I'm sorry. Thumbs number nine. Ah, thank you. That's the arches of the bridge. I could have done this on a bigger scale, Diana, but I think this is sort of just about right for me because uh, I am learning how to do landscapes, so I don't want to get too big. Okay, I'm just gonna adjust the arch. And what, si what size are you working on? And um, I can tell you one second. Uh, nine by twelve inches. Yeah. Is that inches? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, nine nine. Okay, nine, nine by twelve, 12 inches. That's it. Yeah, regular size paper. That's um. What is that? Is that A four? Uh. I think so. I'm not familiar. So I'm, it's approximately A4. A4 yeah. is, they don't use that in the United States. It's, I don't think um, it's made. Yeah. That's, but what, oh, maybe they do, but not that often. For If they say A4, that's really kind of like less common than just coming out with the size and in inches. All right. Hello. Oh, shout out to the 12 in the chat watching. Thank you, guys. Buzzard is dropping a link for his song, I think. And I'm just about done here on the sketch. I like to uh, have he said Chucky let loose this morning because old beer buzzard, his first name is Chuck. So he said Chucky let loose this morning. <laughs> With your song, I guess. Your song creation. <laughs> You know, I've seen you comment on his songs. His songs are funny. Yeah, I like his songs. <laughs> they cheer me up, uh, his songs. Yeah. 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 I just been uh, to uh, to feed my guinea pigs, Diana, and uh, they go bananas. <laughs> they always make me laugh, do guinea pigs. They're so cute. Oh, whenever they hear you coming because they know they're going to get fed? Yeah, they go berserk. <laughs> it's quite my hard. My cats do. My cats go crazy when they, they know they're yeah. going to be fed. 
they, they, <laughs> they want my one cat meows her head off. <laughs> Crazy. Yes. <laughs> when she knows she's going to be fed. And then I have two cats, but the other cat, she meows a little bit, but she she goes it's so funny because the one cat goes crazy over the wet canned food and the other cat goes crazy over the dry food really? oh. yeah and it's like and the cat that loves the dry food will actually like rub rub her head against the dry food bag and everything oh that's cute <laughs> she's <Yeah>. crazy <laughs> There's so many crazy things my cats do. That's just the, that's just the iceberg, the tip of the iceberg of it. Yeah, um, that's what Harley, the dog, does. My brother's dog. She'll sit in front of her treat bag, which is this huge bag. Yeah. And she'll sit there and she'll just stare at this bag for you know for ages. It's so funny. Hmm. And she and then she and then if you're walking past past the, this bag, she'll look at you and she'll put her head up all the way up and she'll be like. Look at me, I'm cute. Give me a treat. <laughs> yeah. They are cute, aren't they? Dogs and cats. I like dogs and cats. Yeah, they're yeah, they're fur babies. Yeah. My fur babies, yeah. They always make me chuckle. I don't know why, but they're quite they're quite comical little critters. Um Yeah. They, they do make me smile. And Madonna says A4 is bigger, is a bit bigger than the U.S. letter size. Well, letter size is eight and a half by eleven, so I believe A A4 is probably nine by twelve. I believe. All right, thank you for that. I did not know. Somebody that. can Google that. Ian should know. Ian knows everything. Uh, Ian, where are you, Mr. Jackson? <laughs> Ian, Ian, A4 is nine by twelve inches. Isn't that is that right? Yeah, I reckon. I think. Um, have I got a oh, even put little emojis of little tiny like uh <laughs> doggies or what are they mice dog no no they're not mice they're like little doggy faces that's cute. Uh, uh, that's cute he says yes a4 is 9 by 12 inches right yeah i thought it was it seemed to ring a bell but you go by centimeters don't you uh I can well, yeah, you can go by that. I I like inches for some reason. Oh, okay, but basically your country goes by centimeters, right? Oh yeah, sure. Yep, yep, yep. You're right. Yeah. So you see, I mean, you can do a painting with the cheaper supplies. Um, but it's just Gracie's and going to show us that today. Now, Gracie, I'm going to say this because we have a bunch of new people in the chat. She does have a big collection of paints, very all the way from very expensive Holbein, and I think there's another expensive paint she has. She yeah. does own very expensive paints, but she chooses today, I don't know why, but she's choosing today to use children's watercolor paint. Yeah. So I think let's get a fairy there. Oh, I'm terrible. I'm a terrible person. I bought another paint set. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm terrible. I need to take either my own advice, Diana. Don't buy any more. Not for a bit, anyway. Well, yeah, I shouldn't, buy, I shouldn't buy more art supplies, but um, I just did buy... Art I saw it advertised on Pinterest and usually I, I don't I don't succumb to advertising that much really. If I decide I want something, it's because I've because I've seen somebody else use it, but I really don't succumb to advertising that much. But I saw an advertisement on Pinterest for the Arteza watercolor markers. Watercolor mm -hmm. markers. Um something I think there's called something else. Watercolor marker, uh watercolor marker uh that kind of brush that kind of what's that kind of oh brush? you mean um oh it's uh, not a hard tip brush you know it's the that's it uh brush tip. Tip. Real pen brush brush tip. Tip. it's a brush tip but yeah it's um watercolor marker brush tips and i that's saw it. them and they, and they show be, them being used and it and it's a reasonable price and i read the reviews the reviews were great people say for the price it's really great so it's 48 colors yeah. and 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 it was a good price and 
see, I like to, when I paint on the couch down in the living room, I don't feel like hauling, I can't haul out all my acrylic paints because for acrylic paint, I really need to be sitting at a table or standing like at my work yeah. table or sitting at, an, uh, sitting at a table or standing at a table. And, but sometimes a lot of times if I just want to create art when I'm sitting on my couch then I, I've been using my Tombow water soluble markers, but I thought I'd try these Arteza. They attracted me, the Arteza watercolor, uh, paint, yeah. um, Paint, what are they called? Paintbrush markers? Uh, watercolor. Uh, Brush markers. Yeah, I think so, yeah. I think so. Yeah, so, I like our tests. They're very good. They're very good. Yeah, I think they I, I think they are. They got really good reviews. And, and I heard you, I think I heard you say something good about them too. Yeah, there's some I mean, our Yeah. They're a very good company. Them. If you're listening, Arteza. <laughs> oh dear. Wow. It's Nightbot here yet. Oh, Nightbot. Yes, Nightbot is always here. <laughs> That's what he gets paid to do. Uh, no, actually, he doesn't get paid. It's free. Nightbot is free. <laughs> Let's just see if I can lift a bit of cloud here. Oh, oh, go ahead. Do you like the sky? It's kind of a moody sky almost. This one. Oh, yeah, it is a little bit moody, yeah. It's a moody sky. Uh oh. <laughs> brush pens. Madonna says brush pens. That's right. Brush ah, pens. Yeah. Watercolor brush pens. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you got it. And Ian came out with the exact size of the A4. The A4 is 11 and 5 8 inches by 8 and 2 8 inches. Oh, my goodness. Uh, okay, yeah. let's just say, what are they? Um, let's just say, oh, God, really? <laughs> I can't even say 9 by 12. But I, I would just say 9 by 12 anyway. Yeah, just say 9 by 12. I mean... I've oh never heard God. of two eights. Two eights is a half. There we go. Two eights is there's no such thing as two eights. That's a half. So let's see. It's eight. It's eleven and five eighths by eight and a half. Yep. That sounds right to me. If I'm right, I believe two eights is really one half. If anybody really knows about math, let me know. Yep. I'm watching. I'm keeping an eye on Facebook, but nothing's going on there. And at least I can follow. I can follow the chat on my computer. Yeah. Oh, hello, Alexis Kit Enterprises. Hello, Alexis. She was at my live stream yesterday. Oh. Mm. Hello. She says, hello, ladies. I'm on the road, so I can't chat, but I am watching the painting. Watch out watching. You should only be listening. She says it's beautiful. Yeah. She <laughs> says it's beautiful. Oh, you should not be watching the painting unless you're at a stoplight or something. You should be only listening, Alexis. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I have a big I have a big thing about people that um well, text and drive, but um, yeah, I'm just saying. doing something else really, but like, while they're driving. Yeah. Oh, I must say this. Uh, thank you to Pickering mm -hmm. for the idea to uh, paint Big Ben. Thank you for the idea. Yeah. And uh, th uh, they came up with another idea for me for next week, and next week's going to be a wildlife pond. Oh. oh, did they vote or they did they vote on this? They did, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, you wrote in at Pickerick's channel. I did, yeah. Oh, that's very nice. It is. <laughs> and there were like there were about four votes, and I was like, well, you know what? Four four votes is good enough for me. <laughs> Hold on, I, I'm dying. I'm trying to experiment because I'm dual live streaming. Right now to Facebook and YouTube and uh huh. Okay, let me see something because I just I just experimented with something making a con. Oh, Pickerick's here! Hi, Pickerick. Hello, Pickerick. 
Oh, he says, oh, wow, beautiful painting, Gracie. Oh, thank you. I'll show Picker Rick the, the, here we go. Can you see that one, Rick, and everybody in the chat? That's the first one, guys. This is the first That's one. That's your practice painting. Yeah. Oh, hi, Green Wizard. Hello, Green Wizard. Oh. Oh, hi, Chrissy Canvas Art. Nice to see you guys. Thank you for coming in. Appreciate oh, and Chrissy, Chrissy says, um, looking good, looking great, Gracie. Thank you, guys. Uh, thank you, Pickerick. And uh, did you say Ron was here? Yes, and Ron's here under the Green Wizard. Ah, and Chrissy. Thank you. Yeah, and Chrissy. Welcome, everybody. So nice to see you. Oh, thank you, guys. Uh, right now, I'm dual live streaming to Facebook and YouTube. Yeah, that's scary stuff, Diana. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, I think I'll probably have a have another one of those YouTube breakdowns if I had to do that online. Oh, good news, Diana! I have um, an iPad now. Um, oh, yeah. yeah, my brother what? very kindly treated me to um, an iPad, um, and they're going to teach me how to use it so I can see chat um on the live one oh so, that's good yeah and i can have it just here i can have the ipad just next to me here like on my desk or whatever oh my goodness i just thought uh, that's really good but i just i just discovered something about facebook live two people are watching on facebook but a uh, hello to the two people watching on facebook because i'm dual live streaming right now to facebook and youtube and i just i just discovered a feature that showed me how that how many people are watching on oh I just, they just showed me that there are two people watching on Facebook, which I had not known before. Okay, oh. so anyway, that's well, that's good news, Gracie. Yeah, about the um, iPad. Yeah, I was going to do a live stream of how I actually figure out how to work the thing. I think that would be hilarious <laughs> if I actually filmed me trying to figure the iPad out. I'm, I'm not very technical, Diana. I'm, um, I'm getting better at the technical stuff. I'm technical. I can do some things, but um, I can't do everything. But I know how to do some things. So, yeah. Well, if you have any questions about using your iPad, just let me know because I certainly have a lot of experience on it. Yeah. So, what do we think to the colors, guys? On my uh, rather cheap. Uh, these are just inexpensive. They were about. Um, I, I got them, Diana, because they're small. Um, and they are actually a travel set of watercolors. And I thought when these, when they, these are called cakes, if they're circles, they're called cakes. If they're square, uh, this is for beginners. Um, and if they're square or like that, this yeah. means they're pans. These are called pans and these are called cakes. Um, and this set is, um, this is artist grade paint in this white box here. Um, this is White Knight's watercolours, um, and I bought them mostly one by one, um, and that's how I build up my uh, professional uh, pro paints. So, and I thought once these are empty, I can maybe put my um, whole bind uh, in the all my sennelier in the um, in the little circles there. Wow. Then, that's why I bought it really, and it's and it's really small palette. Look, it's tiny. There, look. That's your uh, that's a little palette that goes with the paint. So that's really why I bought it. Okay, yes, um, because Gracie has a large collection of paints, including very expensive. But she's choosing today not to use her expensive Holbein paints, and she's using what would you say children's watercolor paints? They are. I have the brand right here with me, and that's the brand there, guys. And she it's is painting in her pajamas. Yeah, yes, it's true. It's true. Grace the paint in the <laughs> Oh no. Oh, it's out now, Diana. <laughs> Painting in a pajamas, everybody. <laughs> hey, it might catch on, you never know. I might be starting a trend. <laughs> um, I'm just joking, guys, I'm just joking. Um, it's a very uh, very good company, um, this company. It's called Mont Montmarte. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, and you get 18 colours, um, you know, so, uh, yeah, I like them. I think they're kind of cute little them. But really, if you compare them to your most expensive watercolour paints, there must be a big difference. Oh, oh, yeah. I might do a video on that, Diana, 
uh, that would be a really good idea. Yeah. So, um, I've used yellow ochre, which is um, a really pretty yellow, and it's very similar to like, uh, you know, the color of mustard. Um, right. It's, oh, yeah. it's, kind of, it's kind of that kind of mustard like color. And uh, with this one, um, on the top, on the top part of the paint that I've got laid down already, I went in with a metallic gold um, to make it shiny like there. And it gave it a bit of contrast against the, you know, against the, the mustard yellow colour. So, yeah. I really, I really like this one, Diana. Yep. Uh, let me catch up on the comments. I was trying to figure out something on Facebook. Uh, for the second time only, I've been, I'm dual live streaming to Facebook and YouTube and uh Oh, hi, Mr. Gunagon. So now I got to catch up on YouTube chat. Hi, Mr. Gunagon has joined us. Hello, Mr. We have four yeah, sorry. Hello. Sorry. <laughs> no, you said hello. Go ahead. Um, hello, Mr. Hello. There you go. <laughs> and I we have four shout out to the 14 people have, that have joined us. Wow. Thank you, guys. Let's see, I'm going to catch up on just, just parked. Oh, Alexis just parked. Okay. Oh, good. Thank goodness for that. Yeah. And Shay's World said you're good. Oh, thank you. And... Mm -hmm. Oh, and then the, the color, the mustard color you were trying to talk about, it's called yellow ochre. That's it. Yeah, yellow ochre. I forgot about that word, too, and I, I would have known that word, but Ian just said it yellow. He just said yellow, or you could just say ochre. Yeah. I know that word, and I, and I well, actually, I just, I was, I was um distracted because I'm trying to follow two, I'm trying to follow two live streams you're supposed to follow i have to follow look at the stream going i mean i keep checking on facebook but um one person i there's one comment when i try to check the comment i can't even get to it and i think it's my comment i think it's my comment and if it's not i keep trying to check the comment and i can't check it i, I couldn't figure out how to get to it it's like weird and yeah, it does sound rather tricky, I have to say. I really like that sky, Diana. It's, um, you know, um, yeah, imagine, yeah. Imagine, imagine you've never been to England before and it's your first time in England and you see that sky over the tower. You know, there's a bit of contrast there. I will put a bit of purple in the water just for that bit of contrast because... A lot of this painting is mainly that yellow ochre colour. So I'm just trying to give it a little bit more um, contrast. Yeah. That's the word I was looking for. And Bud says you look good in your jammies. <laughs> Thank you, Bud. <laughs> Everybody knows. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Um, oh, well. you got to be comfortable, haven't you, Diana? Yeah. yeah. There you go. And Pickerick says, magnificent, bravo. Oh, yeah, you. it's not done yet. That's oh. what you say at the end. <laughs> okay. But anyway, that's very supportive. Oh, thank you, uh, Pickerick. Thank you. How is Elvis doing today? I hope I get to dog sit Harley at the weekend, Diana. I, I try and get to mm -hmm. dog sit Harley as much as I can. <laughs> Because she's such a sweet dog. Mm. That's your brother's dog? Yeah, she's a the cross. Brother, the dentist? He is, yeah, he's a dentist. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I love my brother to bits, but I do not like dentists. <laughs> uh, I would never choose to be a dentist. I, I like oh, them for no. what they need to do. I like them for taking care of my teeth. Uh, I don't like it when they have to give me yeah. Make give me pain, which is not that often because I have like pretty good teeth. The last time I had a cavity was when I was a child, so I, I've never had cavities, I, I've never had a root canal. I don't have problems with my teeth like that. Um, 
but uh, I actually do think I have something going on right now that I'm going to, with one of my teeth and um, I'm, so I got to wait, I got to wait and see what happens with that. Might be my first, I mean, yeah. I've had a problem with, I do have the problem with grinding my teeth. So I have to wear a, a, a dental, a night, I mean, I have to wear a dental, I mean, a, the yeah. dental night guard at night for some reason. I don't know. I'm not aware of myself grinding my teeth, but whatever. So, um, and that's created a, that created a problem where they had to fill yeah. in something. And I said, and then it was so painful. And I said, is this like the same thing they do when you have to get a cat with cavity filled? And she said, yes. Even though it was not getting a cavity filled, it was like filling in one of the divots from grinding my teeth. I created divots in some in my, two, in my one of my molars. Oh wow! And I have a dental guard to wear at night, so so I'm like, but sometimes I fall asleep on the couch and I'm like, and before bedtime, and I I don't have my dental guard in my night guard in or whatever they call it, and yeah. so maybe that's when it happens. I'm never aware of grinding my teeth. It's so weird. Mm. I know some people sleepwalk. Oh, I've seen a show on that. Some people, I've heard, I saw a show where somebody was driving. They were driving while they were asleep. I'm, I'm, I'm just tapping the paper because it's not very flowy. Um, so you can, don't be afraid to pick up your paper and tap it like that. And then you can oh. see, look. Can you oh, see when you that? tap it, what does that do? It makes the paint travel. Um, the, the only place that paint will, will flow is if it's got uh, a wet uh, background, uh, which is called wet on wet. Um, yeah. And and if you just if because they're so cheap and inexpensive, they're not going to be super flowy like Holbein or Sennelier or any of the other professional brand of watercolors. Um, so you have to give it a little bit of a helping hand, and you can kind of. I know it's oh. on camera, but that that's what you do. Um, and then, as you can see, look, it's gone. It's it's gone. It's all moved, you know. Oh, and Rosanna's here. Hello, Ro Rosanna. Hello, Rosanna. Oh, um, Rosanna's dog's called Emily. I think. I think. Yeah, I remember that. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, Gaswina saying something. What is he saying? The whole world. Ah, uh, Gaswina is joking. She says the whole world knows now that you're in your pajamas. No. <laughs> oh, however, when I can. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, thank you guys for coming in the chat. That's very good. I'm just going back to my uh, original painting just to have a a quick look to see if I need to add anything and uh, like any more details. So, you just painted the sky and the water right now. I did, yeah. And um, mm -hmm. I let, I, I kind of put a lot of water down, and then you get what's uh, it's kind of uh, it looks like far away clouds almost right yes. there and there. Uh, and then I might put a bit of uh, a bit of purple in this water because it's just going to give it a bit more um, contrast. Now, so I'm just going to pop that picture there. So, who do we have in the chat, Diana? Well, I just noticed I nobody knew. Uh, Rosanna was the last person to join, uh, but that's a shout out to the 14 people in the room. Thank you. But I just noticed I got two comments and one share on Facebook, and I want to access these comments. Ah. That's the challenge. Where is it? Where's the comment? It's not like normal. Like, you know, I know how to access my comments when I'm on, like, when I'm on just regular Facebook. Uh-huh. Um, this is kind of weird. I oh, I have to ask my friend, I guess. Yeah. And um, I've got my very trusty old uh, water bucket. We've got dirty water and clean water. Um, if you don't have one of these, you could use what glass jars or some form of containers. Um, but you need. Here we go. I to, I'm sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> Well, I just accessed, I just figured out how to access the comments. So here we go. It's Bruce 
Oh, let me hold on. <laughs> it's okay. Bruce. Hello. Hi, Bruce. It's it's my friend Shyam Shaw. And then it disappears. Come on, stop. Shyam. Oh, this, this is a little annoying. Come on. Come on. Comments on. Shyam Shaw is watching with you. Bruce Anderson is watching. Thank you, guys. Oh, and hi Bruce. Hello. Hi, Bruce. hi. Hi Diane. Hello. Hi you guys. Hi everybody. <laughs> and if you use the side of your flat brush and you do some stroking movements like that. That really gets the 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 look of the ripple in the water, the current, and you can come. You just go up and down like that. And then, if you're learning, if you're just learning this, actually say the words swoosh, swoosh, swoosh. Like uh, that's what Bob Ross used to say. Yeah. And he said it really does help you get in the um, the ripples in the water. Oh, yeah. Talking, yeah. Talking while you paint is a good thing. Yeah, and it kind of helps you with the movement of the paintbrush. Bye, Rosanna. She has to leave. She has an appointment. Bye, Rosanna. Bye, Rosanna. Thank you for popping in the chat. Yeah. Very good. Thank you, guys. Nice to see Green Wizard. I haven't I haven't seen him for a while, Green Wizard. I had recently messaged him, so maybe yeah. that um that made him remember me. Uh, he probably forgot about me because we hadn't we hadn't um we hadn't chatted recently on anywhere, like on instant messenger or anywhere. So and I haven't seen I have not seen him in any live stream, so mm -hmm. well Let's see what live streams. The live streams I usually go to, he wouldn't be there. But oh yeah, I was recently at Pick a Rick's live stream and I didn't see him there. So yeah, but I did recently message Ron. So yeah, let's see. <laughs> All right. Anybody else in Facebook? Let's check. Oh, Ian's in Facebook. Hello, Ian. Ian's trying to double dip in Facebook and YouTube. Because <laughs> he was just in YouTube. He's testing it. Yes. Hello, Ian. Let's see what who else. Hello, Ian. Comment is going is crazy in Facebook. They don't comments on doesn't stay on. It stays on and then it disappears. Like, like what's really? that? Like craziness. Come on. <laughs> um hi Ian. LOL. I'm stalking. Hi <laughs> Ian. Hi all. <laughs> and also Bruce Anderson is double dipping. He's at Vermont Paint and F Photo and Paint and YouTube and Bruce and Bruce and Bruce Anderson on Facebook, which I don't mind. Cause I, I like I, I like you to be in my YouTube because I because that way I get watch time and everything and my views go up. Yeah. So I don't mind you guys. Oh, 17. Shout mm -hmm. out to the 17 people watching and listening. Thank you guys. That's cool. Thank you, guys. Just did a bit of dry brush technique to get that uh, the look of the, um, the bridge. So you don't need hardly any paint on your brush. So it's going to be uh, a wildlife pond next week. Oh, that means it's going to be like teeming with wildlife? Yeah. Good idea. Mm. See, I would never have thought of that. Really? Well, that's, what, that's the first thing that came to my head when you said wildlife pond. <laughs> yeah. Well, 
Well, I'll tell you what, I'm really happy with this painting. I, uh, I, I really like this one. I think we are our own worst critics, uh, we artist people. I think, I think we are, you know, I think we're too hard on ourselves. Um, like, yeah, sometimes we are. And sometimes we need to take, we need to take constructive criticism without getting upset. That's the other thing. Uh, yeah, I'm not good with criticism. <laughs> so, you can, because you can learn from it. Yeah, yeah. I'm not. Um, oh, um, Grayscale painting. Hello. Oh, hello, Grayscale. Hello. I don't know if we can on Diana. I always wonder. Oh, uh, let's see. Out of curiosity. About 50 minutes. Five mm -hmm. zero. And it looks like Ian on Friday, on Friday at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, uh, my guest artist every Friday, Ian, is going to paint Rotterdam, the Rotterdam skyline. Oh, wow. That's cool. Now then, what was I going for? I need to know. Oh, yeah, I'm going to paint Rotterdam. Let me see. You said metallics? I did, yeah. I use a um, metallic gold color. Yeah. Um, uh, which is that one? Um, I, love, I love metallics. Me too. Uh, and I put it just like on the top of that building there, a little bit on Big Ben, and a little bit on the building, and then I might put a bit on the uh, on the bridge too. It just adds a little bit of uh, a different colour, you know. Oh well, yeah, it looks like the sun. It gives it the effect that the sun is shining on it. Yeah. Yeah. Let me see, where's my paintbrush? There we are. Oh, Chrissy Canvas Art. Hello. She's in Facebook now. She goes, I'm busy. She goes, I'm busy, but Chrissy Canvas Art joined in Facebook. Thank you, Chrissy. Hi, Chrissy. Thanks in Facebook. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, that's looking good. How many are watching? Oh, let's say shout out to the 15 people watching. Wow, that's cool. Thank that's you, guys. Good, that's a good number for my channel. Yeah, thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, I'm just going to go in and draw a few not darker lines. And Grayscale Painting says he uh, he goes, I have a good crowd today. Oh, I know on Wednesday he does live. I thought, I thought that was live. I thought he did live stream painting at night. Yeah. Anthony, you already did your live stream painting? Oh, yes, I know. I think he does it on Facebook. He does. He has a lot of uh, he has a lot of followers on Facebook that follow him his paintings. Oh, cool! That go to his live streams on because he does alternately like he'll live stream on YouTube, but he also live streams on um Facebook. Oh. he has a bunch of followers on Facebook that will not come to YouTube. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. You can't. There we go. Just get those little lines in there. Uh, hello, Rick Chadwick. Rick Chadwick is watching from Facebook. Hello, Rick Chadwick. Hello there. Oh, that's the thing in Facebook. They they give the name of the people who are watching. <laughs> oh, that's they true. Don't do that in YouTube. In YouTube, they don't tell you who's watching. 
in Facebook, they give the name of the people who are watching. Wow. Welcome, Rick Chadwick. Welcome. Hello. 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 Just going to go over the lines. Do you know what I've been watching on TV lately, Diana? What? Um, do you remember in the early 90s, Sabrina the Teenage Witch? I I rem no because I re I remember the name of that but I never followed it because I followed the original of Sabrina Sabrina just Sabrina the witch yeah it was, it was just called Sabrina oh okay. Sabrina was a mother well, she was a mother and a wife right. she was a mother and a wife and her and her daughter were her her daughter Tabitha were both and, and her mother were all witches but her husband was not and the uh -huh. craziest things and 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 on all the episodes the craziest things happened yeah oh i don't know that one i should know that one but i don't recall. no i'm older than you so you maybe you probably don't know that mm. so that's yeah. where the when they they say sabrina the teenage witch they, see they're they're using that word name sabrina but that she wouldn't have been they're using, they got that name from that show, the original oh, show. Wow. But I don't know that show is that related. I don't know if that show is related to the, the um, sitcom. Uh, I did not know that. Oh, it was called Bewitched. I'm sorry, you're right. Uh, uh, Bean Anderson corrected me. That's that, that show. Bewitched. You remember that song? You remember that show? Yeah, I, I like that one. That's good. Yeah, Bewitched. I'm sorry. You're wrong. I was wrong. So, thank you for reminding me that. Yeah, I totally forgot that name. Bewitched. That's right. Uh, don't worry about it. I like Bree they have a they have a talking cat called Salem and he's like he's so funny. He oh He's the main reason why I watch that program. The, the little cat, he's a black cat. Um, and he's got the best best lines, best jokes. <laughs> yeah. And Bruce Anderson says, wow, a pocket watch? Nice, Gracie. Oh, yeah. I got it at Christmas, Bruce. There we go. It's, uh, it's not even expensive. Um, and it's like a vintage one. Uh, oh, it's 6 o'clock here in, uh, in England. No, Bruce Anderson says he's old. Oh, hey, Bruce Anderson. Uh, I bet I'm older than you, Bruce. <laughs> maybe not. Maybe not. We might be the same age. You might be young. I'm older. Guess what? I'm older than Grayscale Painting. <laughs> yes, I am. And I was surprised to learn that, but I am. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tell how much older. <laughs> well, you don't look it. Thank you. Hi, you're welcome. Oh my goodness. It feels funny going earlier, doesn't it? What do you mean earlier? Are we, are we what time did we go live? One o'clock is the, is the time we've always went. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm lost with the time today. Did You didn't have your time change yet, did you? See, we, we put our clocks ahead last Saturday, so when did you? You didn't do that yet. When are you guys supposed to put your clocks ahead? Uh, you don't know? Like maybe it might be this weekend or probably next weekend or something. It, it could be. I will have to Google that one. <laughs> I Google a lot of stuff. Oh, Bruce Anderson's older than Grayscale Painting too. Oh, really? That's what he just said. Yeah, I'm. I'm getting the hang of following along in Facebook. I figured out how to um follow the chat now in Facebook. Oh. It, took, it took a little bit, but I figured it out. I you just tap the screen. You tap the screen. It's it's weird, but all I do is just tap the screen to to, to keep making the comments pop up. Ah. Oh. Yep. I did. So I can follow you guys. I can follow you guys. Oops. Uh, get some more water. I'm just gonna spread the paint around a little bit. 
And shout out to the 14 people still watching in YouTube chat. Oh, thank you guys. Much appreciated. And then there's that bit down there. So I'm going to go into the bank. Mm -hmm. I'm really happy with this one, Diana. That's good. Let's see. Are you working on the building now, right? I am, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I haven't used a big brush on this one, have I? <laughs> you could have used a big, I don't know, but you could have used a big brush in the sky, probably. Yeah. I like how you did the clouds. They're not, like, too perfect. They're, like, natural and organic looking. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I know what you mean. They're not too regular, like too repetitive, like too much the same. They always say that like about organic thing, like na natural objects. They, you can't like keep repeating a pattern over and over. You got to keep, you got to make it irregular patterns. So big Big Ben is in London, yeah, right. Good. Yeah. Yeah. I've never well, I've never been to the UK, so oh thank oh, and Rick Chadwick says thank you. I have to go. Oh, you're welcome, Rick Chadwick. Thank you for stopping by. It's every Wednesday, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We do this. Every Wednesday. I, this was my second time dual live streaming though on YouTube and Facebook. Yeah. Usually I just live stream to YouTube. So um or if you're free, Rick Chadwick, come back again at 4 p.m. today, Eastern Standard Time, because we're going to have NASCAR man um, drawing drawing cartoons. Where did I put that shot? Uh, doobie doobie doo. <laughs> you need to paint that. There should be like music or something. I want to pick a Rick's back. Or you say because I have a Hamilton twenty one jewel railroad pocket watch. Oh, do you know about his pocket watch? Um, a Hamilton twenty one jewel railroad pocket. Oh, watch. I know. what was it? Rick? Was that like used to be owned by like a railroad engineer or something? In the I, I like it because I can put this. I can put this chain watch just here. Uh, so if I'm painting, I can just see it. You know, just see the watch. Uh, and that's the time in England. It is five past six in the evening. And it's uh, what time is it where you are, Diana? We're four, we're four hours behind right now because of that's the time change and. Before we were five, most of the year we're five hours behind you, but today we're, I mean, now we're four hours behind until you do your time change. And Gosselina just told us, yep. just, uh, she just told us when you guys are going to do your time change. It's not going to be all the way until the end of the month. Right. Oh, you. hi, old beer buzzard. Hello, old beer buzzard. Well, I'm my gun betting all these evil politicians now so i come where there is peace and something very good give my six give my six girls and guys love instead of a boom oh thank you all dear buzzers and mystic unicorn says okay i'm home now oh, oh, good. i'm glad you had to save you uh, got home safely yes yeah my goodness I'm waiting, I'm waiting to hear from Pick Rick whether it, his pocket watch is, I assume, is antique, and whether it was um was it was owned by a railroad engineer? I think it was his dad's watch. Um, I think. I seem to remember. I think he mentioned it on a live stream. Oh, USA change time now, or just. Or just no, the whole United States, Ian. It's the whole United States that um went one hour forward 
last weekend. The whole yeah. United States, yes. That's right, yep. Yep, that rings a bell now you say it. Uh, I'm just going to... Oh, I'm nearly out of gold in this set. <laughs> oh, yes, Rick says yes, it was his dad. His dad's watch from the 1800s. Ah. Oh, well, that must have been his dad's dad's watch too. Yeah. Oh, Grayscale Painting says all but Arizona does the time, the time change. Yes, I seem to remember something like that. Arizona, I guess, is the only state that does not do the the, the one hour forward. All right. Okay. Oh, let's see. Bruce Anderson, sorry, baby is up. I have to run. Take care, all. Enjoy. Thank you, Gracie and Diana. Oh, bye. Okay, bye, okay, bye Bruce. Bye, bye. Thank you for popping in the chat. So I had a very kindly read me the chat because um, I can't see the chat. <laughs> Even if you could see it, it would be too distracting while you're working, right? That's a really good point, actually, yeah. I, I, you yeah. Just take, all you do is take money. Like, you paint for, like, 10 or 15 minutes. I used to do a chat live stream on my own, so and I would paint for 10 or 15 minutes and say, okay, guys, I can't see the chat right now, but I'm going to check it, like, in 10 or 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Oh. Now, for the uh, for the clock, for the actual clock, um, this is I use this because um, it's going to stand out more. It's going to be really, really uh, black for the you know for the clock. Yeah, but I'm going to have to wait till that part's dry before I, um, you know, before I add in the uh, the Roman numerals on the clock. Let's see. I need to shout see. out to the 16. No, 15. Is it 15 or 16? 15 people. And I didn't even share this out. And we got that number. Hello, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yep. Yeah, that chain watch. I bought that at Christmas. Uh, how much was it? Oh, the whole watch? Just the chain, you said, or the whole watch? Oh no, the whole watch. I can't remember now how much it was, but it, it wasn't expensive or anything. I'd like to have like a, a proper one, you know, like a, 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 that's just a, the one that I have is just cheap, but I'd really like to have like a, an authentic one. Um, but my, my, my granddad. I used to have a private watch too that I inherited from my grandfather. Oh wow! My grandfather never wore um, a chain watch, so I don't remember him either wearing one. So, was it for my grandfather? Oh, I can't remember. It might have been for my mother, but and she might she must have gotten it from her father. I'm not sure. Uh -huh. Okay, I I have to take just a, a two minute break. Oh, she back in like two two minutes. Okay. <laughs> Um, I can't read the chat, guys, so um, we will have to wait till Diana comes back. Uh, I'm basically just adding the blue into the sky areas where I've gone. I really like that sky. And if you look at that sky and you look at this sky, um, yeah, I like that. There we go. So I'm going to rinse my brush up again. And I'm going to go into this. I think it. I think this might be an ultramarine blue. This particular shade of blue. Uh, and I'm just going to let it flow over this area. I don't really like pushing paint around as such, but sometimes you have to. And then you go into your colour there. You just side my hands in the way. Um, uh, do that, and you just kind of let the paint do its thing. That's why I like watercolors, is because it flows, and um, it's uh, it's fun to watch where the where the paint goes. You never know where it's going to go. Yeah, sorry guys, I can't read the chat. I'm back. Yeah, you should back. 
Oh, I'll be panicking then, Diana, for a minute. <laughs> Don't leave me. <laughs> oh, we have somebody. Oh, Skeeter's here. He, back. He says, hi, yeah. Hi, Skeeter. And we have AP Crafts 24. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hello, hello, AP Crafts. Hello. Um, no, then. I think I'm going to put a bit more purple in the in the time. So, Tam, sorry. Uh, so, I'm going to need my paintbrush. There we go. So, I'm going to go into purple. Put purple metallic. They're quite nice, these metallics, Diana. They're not bad. Um, the metallic is there. Yeah, uh, it's called Cosmic Shimmer. Oh, what's that, like a, a, a deep blue? Uh, yeah. Yeah, um, I think it's a blue. Yeah, it is a blue. It looks a bit purple. Yeah, it's purpley blue. Yeah. So I do what Bob Ross said. Swoosh, swoosh, swoosh. Oh, you're adding that to the water? I am, yeah. Oh, just, that's good. I I was going to say, I, I, I thought the water should be darker. Yeah, this is the, the one thing I do struggle with is contrast. Um, but I'm getting better at contrast. It just... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm glad you're making the water darker. Yeah, and it kind of, and it kind of gives it a sense of re realism as well. Yep. Yeah, my grandpa, he never he never wore a watch, but I would love to have had a, you know, one if, if he ever did have a watch. Oh. So Skeeter's in the house. Is Slee yeah. stuck Oh, here? no, Slee Stack's not here, nope. Oh. Unless I'm wrong, I don't think I don't think Lee Stack is here. No, no, I just wondered. I, I really wondered. Oh, Skeeter goes dong, dong, dong. Oh, because of Big Ben. <laughs> yeah. Well, then Skeeter says tea time. Mhm. Mm oh, I've already had my dinner, uh, Skeeter. I'm way ahead of you there. <laughs> but do you have like tea time? Uh, what you mean? Like have a cup of tea? <laughs> yeah, like we have like a, like an official time of day that's called tea time. Uh, yeah, kind of between six and seven. I can't really eat really late because mm. uh, it affects my diet, you know indigestion eating late. But um, but yeah, kind of six seven o'clock around about that time. Oh, ah. well, I thought tea time would be like in the afternoon before dinner oh, sometimes. I mean, like in the, yeah, I do. I do have a. I don't usually drink caffeine after, um, say, ooh, two o'clock, because otherwise I'll be up all night and I won't be able to sleep. So. <laughs> oh, so, we got some comments. We have some. Uh, Mystic Unicorn says Diana and Gracie marathon. The practice makes perfect. Thing I suggested to her. Uh huh. You know what she's talking about. Uh oh, I'm hopeless. Could you could she remind me on Messenger? because uh, I don't remember. Sorry. And Ian says I am stalking a fountain pen on the internet. It will be mine. <laughs> Did you say that, Ian? Oh. Oh, that's interesting, Ian. Yeah. And it's we're not sure, Mystic. We're not sure what you're saying. I forgot. And then, what hello, Doogie's gluten free lab. Welcome. Welcome. Hello. Now, then, these troublesome Roman numerals were really, really tricky. <laughs> I found that part really difficult. So, yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. And Facebook is quiet right now. Nobody's there. Yeah, it's funny how um, it's funny how um, 
different social media work. Maybe if I, you know, today I'm going to be broadcasting, I'm going to dual stream too this, today at four o'clock, but if I do it more often, maybe more people start coming. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. Hold on. I can't read my own revenue. <laughs> One, two, three. One, two. I'm glad you guys like my painting. That, uh, that's good. Thank you, guys. Oh, Ian has the information. He says, Big Ben is the bell in the tower and not the tower itself. Ah, okay. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Okay. I did not know that, Mr. Jackson. Thank you. I'm just going to, if I can, um, let me see now. Let's see. How can I do this? I just want to see the uh, the clock um, on my screen. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Shout out to the 10 people in the chat. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you. Thank you, guys. Yep. Yeah. And did you want a time check? Sorry? Did you want a time check? You, a lot of times you ask me the time. Oh, okay. Um, oh, um, of course, this painting's taking you longer than usual paintings because of the complexity of it. <laughs> it it's, uh, well, it's 2.15 my time, so yeah, 6, six fifteen your time. I am just about done. There we are. I think if I play with that anymore, I think I'm going to overwork it. And it's kind of, it's it's kind of um, healing a little bit. The paper it's buckling, which means it rises. Um, you know, for you know a beginner. Um, yeah. So I, I think we can call that one done, Diana. Oh, uh, well, did you put the details on the architecture? Uh, the yeah. lines. What about the in the other painting? Didn't you have lines in there? Yeah, they seem to have. I I, I will try. Put them back in. Oh, you mean you, you were going to skip a step? No, no, no. You just reminded me to do the windows. Oh. There may be windows. Oh, yeah, okay. On the building. I must have um, washed away some of the pencil lines with mm. the tape. Oh, I do. Yes. So I, I quite like this paper. It's not bad. What is that paper again? Um, it's Windsor & Newton mm -hmm. uh, Professional Watercolour Paper. Yeah. There you go. That looks better. It's got little windows now. <laughs> and I'm going to go. Yeah. I'm going to go. Oh, okay. Bye, bud. Hello, he says goodbye. He says everybody have a good day and love y'all. Oh, thank you, bud. Ooh. And and AP AP uh, Craft Twenty Four is agreeing with agreeing with Nightbot. Uh, what? What the hell is that? Please visit. <laughs> Cause I'm Nightbot. What is it? Overworked and underpaid. <laughs> yeah, but Nightbot doesn't even get paid, so. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. That looks better. You can see he's got windows now. <laughs> and then. What? Uh, are there going to be windows in the other buildings? Yep, yeah, there are. I'm just having a, a quick look. Um. Yeah. Right, okay, so for this one, and feel free to turn your paper around so it's comfortable for you to, uh, to draw. Right. Yeah. 
and they're just basically squares for the windows. I think that's why I I, I did it. I, I broke everything down into simplistic shapes, um, which is what Mr. Jackson suggested I do, and that's really helped me get this painting right. Um, how do we like it then, guys? Okay, let me. I'm reading the chat. Hold on. Grayscale paint says they will just drop. I don't know. Um, it should be good paper as it's very expensive. It is. And uh, grayscale paintings just saying Diana. I don't know what that means. And then Ian, thank you for telling me how many thumbs up because I'm not watching that. I'm only watching the chat on Streamyard because on I have to use my iPad for following Facebook. So I I can see how many people are. I can see how many people are watching on YouTube, but um, I can't see the thumbs up. Mm -hmm. so thank you for telling me. It was 19 thumbs up. That's good. Thank and you. Then, oh, you said contrast is like something that you're working on, like you have to, yeah. that you're trying to improve contrast uh, in your yeah. painting. It, it is really hard to get contrast in, um, but I'm getting there. Um, yeah. I'll keep going with it. Let's see. Uh -huh -huh. Uh, I'm not sure. I think I should call this one done, Diana, because mm -hmm. I don't want to ruin. Um, you don't want to add more windows? Well, I've got windows here. I tell you what, I could do. I could do this. What colour is that? I can add some windows here. Skeeter says something about the mouse ramp up the clock. <laughs> or ran up the clock or what? Yeah. Huh. No Bob Ross. Ran up the clock. That's it. Ran up the clock. The mouse ran up the clock. Yeah. No Bob Ross jokes this week, Skeeter. <laughs> That did make me laugh. That did that joke. Is that go? Does that come from a nursery rhyme? Uh, I think so. I'm not altogether sure. No, 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 no. Let's see. What color can I put there? Oh, what about Hickory Dickory Dock? Oh, the, of the yeah. clock, right? Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Yep, you're right, that's it. Right, well then, let's see. How do we like it, guys? I think that looks uh, relatively okay. Yeah, you, add, you added a lot of contrast there. Right. Yeah. Well, yeah, that, what do you think of that? Oh, and then there's the bridge, right? That's yeah. the bridge in, oh, that's the bridge. Oh, that's the bridge in the corner. I say. Yeah, it was kind of um, kind of off the page. It was kind yeah. of just a line up with the arches, and then the um, and then the, the retain. There we go. Can you guys see the metallic? Uh, no, that's too hard. I can. Maybe somebody else can, but that's really hard to see on camera. Yeah, I wonder why. You would think. Uh, I don't know why. Things that are sparkly and metallic, um, just for the normal person with their normal camera. I mean, it has to be a professional that's really trying to show off the sparkle and metallic. They can do it, yes. but you have to really know what you're doing to to show off metallic and sparkliness. Yeah, just like a, a normal person with a regular camera, it's too—it's very hard. 
it's hard to you have to keep what you do is you keep angling it under the light in all different angles and then you're gonna see it yeah but you might not even have that much on there that we're gonna even really see it even if you angle it up uh, under the lights a whole bunch of different ways i think yeah you're right it just doesn't it's a shame because it looks really nice when it sparkles <laughs> Yep, yeah, I like my sparkles. Oh, Grayscale Painting is saying, I was saying that if you double stream, you will get, get quite a flow. Oh, yeah. Oh, I hope so. Eventually, so far, not, not that many people came on Facebook. and But eventually, more. if I keep, if I do it on a regular basis, more people, I yeah. but. You have quite a following on Facebook on um, grayscale painting, so that your your situation may may be different than mine. Even though I do have a lot of Facebook friends, like quote friends, they're not you know like I'm friends with them, but they're not really friends. But so they would they should get notifications. I have like eighteen hundred. No, I don't know. Is it eighteen hundred? Eighteen hundred people. And I, and I doubt all those people would get notifications or. Yeah. Well, I mean, 3 p.m. soccer time. Oh, it's not 3 p.m. here. Oh, where would it be 3 p.m.? I'm on the East Coast. It's not 3 p.m. where he lives. Oh, he's just saying. Is that is that 3 p.m. soccer time in the UK? Uh, did you say supper time? Soccer, soccer, the game. I have no idea. I don't He's follow. I'm just making that up. I don't follow. Um, I don't follow uh, football really. Not really. Nope. Um, what I was saying. Okay. <laughs> Mystic Unicorn says in half an hour. Well, in half an hour. Oh, yes. In half an hour, it'll be 3 p.m. Yep. Oh, yeah. So, okay. Gracie's finished. You, everybody, please. Um, everybody can. Um, oh, what do you guys think? There's that one. No, 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 that's one. I like the colors that you used for the for the buildings and, and the sky. Yeah, thank you. I'm not overly keen on this area. I would uh, I would redo that area, but uh, what in the sky? Yeah, that that building there here. Is that build? Which one? The building you're talking about? Yeah, there's a building here, and then there's the bridge. But I would have put a little bit more detail in the in the building here. Um, I don't like the way I put the black to the windows. I, if I had, if I had to paint this again, I would change that building. But I like the, I like these buildings, and I like the clock. I like the, I like the way the bridge was done, and I like the contrast in the water and the sky. I'm really um, pleased with my sky. Yeah, um, the, yeah, I like the sky. Yeah, it's, it's very organic. Yeah, that's the word I was looking for. Organic. <laughs> Shall I uh, sign my name at the bottom? Uh, it's usually here that I sign. Yeah, if you're ready to. I'll, I'll read the chat in a minute. Like I was checking Facebook. Hold on. Probably no one's there. Let's see. Nope, nobody's there. If, unless somebody's watching. Oh, it says nobody's. I can think nobody's watching there. Okay. Ah. There's many more people in faith. You know, shout out to the 10 people. Oh, hi, Be the Difference Clothing. Hello. Oh, she said she loves it. Oh, thank you. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Grayscale, Grayscale says you're going to need plenty of light to show the sparkle. Yeah. Well, in, in person, I'm sure you can see the sparkle much easier than you can see on camera. Yeah. We're just never going to catch it on camera unless it was a bigger space and then you keep angling at different angles under the light and then you can see it. Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh, so, 
let's see. What time is it now? I haven't got the foggiest what time. No, it's, it's around two. It's half past the hour. It's two thirty, so it's six thirty your time. Ah, it feels later than that to me. Uh, Glaswina says it's beautiful. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with it. That 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 went well. Yep. I like um, Westminster. I like how I've done the, uh, the you know, the shapes and everything. Oh, that's Westminster Cathedral? Uh, Westminster um, Houses of Parliament, where um, all the... MPs oh, okay, right. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And Skeeter says he likes it. Thumbs up. Oh, thank you, Skeeter. Thank you. Okay. So, yeah, that that you went longer than you usually do because that that was a more complicated, complex painting. It was, yeah, it was pretty tricky, but um, I'm really happy. Well, you, you think it was easy, but it, it was easy, but it was a lot of steps to it. Yeah. Yeah. Which took longer, like because a lot of times you you're you're done under an hour. <laughs> Well, here we are. It's an hour. It took an hour and a half. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Yeah. You shouldn't be sorry, because um, it's okay. It, it, the time's okay for me. Oh uh, well, yes. Some will get them. Some won't. Oh, he's saying about some will get them and some won't with the Facebook notifications. Oh. Oh, uh, Westminster is a palace. Mm-hmm. Oh, he says it's a palace. You're saying, no, no. oh, I guess he's correcting you. It's not the House of Parliament. It's a palace. Ah, uh, I haven't been to London for. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I haven't been to London in ten years. Really? Well, how far? What do you, how far do you live from London? Uh, about two hours. Uh, Ooh, two, two hours. hours. Yeah. Has the coronavirus come near you yet? Not yet. Touch wood. Oh, it's in our town. Oh, God. Uh, we don't know what to do. No. There's no know. way around it. It's airborne. Apparently, it is not about touching things. It's it's in the, it's in the air. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, so far, we're skipping. And we. my husband found this out last night. Like, he says, oh, we're screwed. We're screwed. Like, so. <laughs> like, <laughs> like uh, we're, like, so. Uh, two our our the school district I live in is closed down for the the for the rest of the week, which I don't which is anyway. And the neighboring school district has closed down for the rest of the week. The the uh, a college that's an hour away, they're closed for the rest of the semester. The whole rest of the semester, they're going to do online online. Wow. Yeah, and another college too, I think, in the area has closed down and just going to put everything online. No students. They tell. They sent everybody off campus. Wow. And it's. Uh, I find it quite terrifying. <laughs> it's like I know because I just like. It's it, the thing is I don't think the symptom. It and they the doctor said that it depends on your immune system on how how severely you would get it. Most people with like a, a decent immune system, it's only going to hit them mildly to moderately. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's only going to hit them mildly to moderately. But do, do you know how it began? Oh, God. Do you know how it began? It began in China. Do uh, they, eat, they eat bats and, and guinea pigs and peacocks? They eat everything. So they're they're so pop overpopulated there and those and this, well anyway the markets it came from bats they eat bats really yeah it came from China so they're on top of each other and the markets the markets just eating all this like crazy I mean all these kind of weird animals and and it, it actually came from bats and then it, I think it mutated oh, I did not know that Diana it, well. Most everybody knows it came from China. I think it's, I'm pretty oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it definitely came from China, but um, to, I, I just learned that the other detail about it came exact, it came from the food markets. Yeah. Oh. 
goodness gracious me. I don't know. And the thing, the thing that's different about the flu, it's, it's just a whole lot more contagious than the flu. It's airborne. Yeah. Uh, As opposed to the flu, the flu, it, it's airborne if somebody sneezes or coughs, but um, a lot of times you can catch the flu or a cold because of touching surfaces and stuff. With this, with the, the coronavirus, it's it's not about touching surfaces. It's like all completely airborne. Yeah. And, I, and I'm not so sure that it's about people sneezing or coughing. It could be, you could just be right next to somebody who's just breathing that has it. Yeah. It's so contagious. It's so contagious compared to the flu. Yeah. Yeah, I can imagine it to be. But it, once you get it, I don't, think, I don't know. I feel like I'm going to get it. I mean, oh my God, what am I going to do? I, I, I got this. We're right. We just we just figured this out last night. Like we're screwed. And like, oh God. Oh, we didn't. Get, my husband decided not to go to the gym today, and he decided not to go to the chiropractor today because our chiropractor just came from overseas in a twelve-hour air, airplane ride, and we're like, oh no, he was like twelve hours on a plane, oh, <laughs> and we're like afraid of him. <laughs> Because the first four days, the first four days, you don't, most people don't even know they have it. And that's when it's the most yeah. contagious in the first four days when you don't even know you have it. So we're like, we're like, wait, let's wait, let's, let's wait next week to see whether he knows if he has it or not. <laughs> <laughs> and instead of going to the gym today, which my husband usually does, he took a walk in the park. Yeah. We, and you know, we, it's, there's so much you can do. This is going to go on. This could go on for months. There's so much you can do to avoid it. We can't live like this. I mean, we're not going to be able to keep doing this like for month after month. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Uh, when I went shopping to Aldi's the other day, uh, they completely ran out of hand sanitizer. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're being, they're, well, yeah, and then you said you got el everybody was like in a rush and you got elbowed. Yeah, fine old lady. Oh, sorry, older lady. <laughs> yeah, I was like, excuse me. <laughs> if you're in Facebook, uh, we're, we're just about to end soon. Thank you for watching in Facebook, but we're just about to end. Yep. I was just reading what they're going to all say about what I said. I know there are going to be tons of people saying something about what I just said. Don't say that, artfully yours. Yeah. Don't That's say right. that. <laughs> Remember to speak life. Oh, okay. Thank you. You're right. <laughs> I got to read some of your book. I got your book of quotes. I got your, I know, I got to read some of your book. Remember to speak life. Yeah. Well, I don't mean that I'm going to die. I'm not, I know I wouldn't die from this, but speak um, a part of being, well, part, I don't know. It's just kind of weird because part of life it can be being sick. I'm not talking about that I would die from this, but yeah. maybe she means speak life like positive, positivity and stuff. Yeah. Oh, I'm really happy with that one. Okay, so, all right, that's good. So, thank you. Thank you for being guest artist every week. Um, she's back here. Uh, if, if, when, if she's able to, usually usually she is able to, um, 1 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yep. She already knows what she's going to paint next week. Yeah. A wildlife pond. <laughs> yep. Um, and, and last week, last week she painted the New York City skyline. Oh, I nearly had a. Oh. <laughs> I nearly had a heart attack and a stroke with that painting. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you everybody for being here. Thank so, you guys, really appreciate well, thank it. Thank you so much. And let's see who's in the chat. If you want to come back at four o'clock, four o'clock, I have another artist, another guest artist, NASCAR man. AKA Derek Camille. And um, today, he, like, like in, well, he likes to draw race cars, but today he's not going to draw race cars. But, and he likes to draw dragons, race cars, but today he's going to draw cartoons. Oh, adult cool. cartoons for adults. Oh, okay. So if, if you want to come back here, 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time.
Uh, what are they saying? Okay, that's good. Oh my God. Yeah, if you want to come back here, I have another guest artist. It's 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time today. NASCAR man. Yeah. He finally got better. He was sick for two weeks. Well, he was sick for a week, and then and then he was like recuperating for another week. So he can finally. Last time he's been on was two weeks ago. Oh. Okay. Uh, okay. Thank you for being a guest artist again. At the same time next week, everybody. Unless um, unless something happens, it's always Wednesday. Every Wednesday, one p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Gracie's on here painting watercolor. Uh, next week it is a wildlife time. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you so much, everybody. Thank you to my moderators, and thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys. And to the eight still watching, to the eight still watching. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Thank you, Diana. No. Okay. Thank you. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye now. Thank you.